Hello everyone, it's been a while since my last video. Um, in this video, I'm just going to share with you quickly uh, the Python code that we wrote recently to extract um, geographic coordinates, uh, longitude, latitude, automatically. And it's called extract core. If you want to use this code, you can get this from my GitHub page. Um, you can go to this link or you can use the link from the description below and um, download it from this uh, button here so you can click this code button and download zip so if you will open the zip file it will give you this file so the main file here that we will use would be uh, this one here the extract core that py right now it can only extract two uh, formats um, the degrees minutes and seconds format and the other one would be the decimal degree um, format so in order for you to utilize this you have to install python 3 java and tesseract um, ocr you have to go to this links to um, in, to install this software and if you're using python 3 when you install the modules here at the bottom you have to put uh, pip 3 here but if you're using older or old versions uh, you can simply use pip here now without further ado let's um, go to our terminal or to my terminal here so i'm using my terminal here um, if you're using windows this might be um, might be different i haven't used this code on windows so i'm not sure if it's uh, going to work 100 percent. but if you're using mac um, I guarantee you that it will work um, it will work 100% uh, so the first thing that you will do once you have installed uh, the requirement so you have to check your Python um, if it's uh, properly installed by um, typing this code here Python version so just to check check the Python that you have or you can use Python uh, 3 here and it will give you the version um, three and then you have to check as well the um, Java Java um, version and it will give me this and then you can check your Tesseract as well if it's uh, working uh, or not and there you go oops um, I think I misspelled All right, there you go. So now let's clear this thing. Now, the first thing that you will do after that would be to go to um, the folder where you stored um, the, the extract core, that py or the code. So I stored it on my home folder. It's here, so it's on my home directory, Christian and extract core folder. So I got um, the files here so this one the extract core py and then the test files here now let's look at the test files I mentioned earlier that it can only extract two patterns so I got here uh, pattern one now let's open this one and see the, the format so oh this one is in um, image format now let's look at the um, PDF one all right there you go so here is my pdf file and you can see here the um, the the longitude and latitude data um, and in and it's in um, decimal decimal uh, no not decimal degrees minutes and seconds uh, format and the second pattern here i downloaded a random um, PDF file here and you can see this one if you want to check this one you can yeah it you can see the map here and uh, you can see here at the bottom the coordinates like for example this one here you can see here the coordinates it's in um, decimal degrees uh, format now um, let's go back to our terminal uh, let's uh, minimize this and go back to the terminal so we have to navigate to the folder and you can do that by uh, going or 
typing cd home christian and then the extract or folder and hit enter and then when you do or when you type ls here it will give you the extra core that py here and our test files so now we're set so what you will do here to run the code is to type um, python or python 3 you can use python 3 or you can use you can just use python here but i'll be using python 3 and then extra core there you go and then hit enter and then it will ask you um, this identified identify the file type um, if you're using PDF or image um, right now if you will be using image like a scanned uh, document um, make sure that the image has a good uh, resolution um, otherwise it will not uh, work so let's uh, go and select PDF you have to type here uh, PDF and hit enter again and then this window will pop out and will ask you to uh, select your pdf file so i put my pdf file here you can see here my directory and i'll open my test files and i'll use pattern one the pdf file here and then click open and then here you go now if you will go back to your folder it will give you this output so i got here my output now i can open it with my um, you can open it with your excel or libreoffice if you're using libreoffice and now it's here now let's uh, look at the pdf file pattern one here and then you can see here um, the coordinates so the first um, site here this one here you can see here now let's test it um, let's test the code for the uh, second pattern so you have to go back to the terminal and you can see here it's still asking you to uh, identify the file type if you're uh, if you're gonna use this again then it will just leave you um, this uh, option but if you want to terminate this just hit enter and it will terminate the um, the code but we have to use it and test the second pattern so let's uh, type pdf hit enter and let's get the second pattern here and then there you go um, go back to your folder and you can see the second file here in decimal degrees uh, format again you can open this with your excel um, or libreoffice and click ok and there you go um, if you want to use this in qgis um, you can open qgis and then let's try it uh, raster uh, this one let's open the osm and then add the csv file there you go let's add and it's on my extra core and then and then make sure to assign the uh, longitude and latitude click add close and you can see there the tiny um, points and then we can zoom in and if you will oops let's uh, modify let's modify the symbol so you can see it clearly there you go if you go back to the pattern one and look at the map here on top you should be able to see uh, the same points the location yep there you go that's it and thank you let me know if you have questions uh, we're still um, improving the code so if it will not work um, let us know let me know so i can help you set up the code thanks and have a good one everyone